Welcome back to Royal Divine, why Meghan Markle stood slightly away from Princess Kate during Queen Elizabeth II's funeral, a guide to her body language, before we continue I encourage you to hit the notification bell. Mourning in her personal way, Meghan Markle appeared to preserve her distance from Princess Kate and her teens, whilst paying tribute to Queen Elizabeth II on Monday, September 19. The Duchess of Sussex 41, opted to stand slightly away from the Princess of Wales, 40, and her eldest children, Prince George and Princess Charlotte, as properly as Queen Consort Camilla during the Westminster Abbey service. Kate and Prince William's youngest son Prince Louis, Meghan's bodily distance could have been for a range of reasons in accordance to body language expert Blanca Cobb one of which is her endured anxiety with the royal family. Meghan's physique language doesn't trace at a relationship with the queen consort, Kate and the children, Cobb completely tells us. However, standing again and at the back of the queen consort, Kate and the youngsters, alerts a viable emotional distance. The ladies have been in attendance for both Monday's Westminster Abbey service, procession, and the committal service at St. George's Chapel following the Queen's demise at age 96 on September 8. The Methods of the Master's author provides that funerals carry out contemplation, reflection and prayer for these who pray and therefore the former Suitsn actress's preference to no longer stand nearer to her spouse and children should have been out of respect. Perhaps she desired to provide them space. Or she wanted some area to mirror and think, Cobb explains. If she believes that their relationship is strained, then it's viable that she stood back. You have a tendency to hold a bodily distance when you don't experience emotionally shut to someone. The bench creator and her husband, Prince Harry, have been somewhat at odds with the Duke of Sussex's family following their 2020 step return from their royal duties. Tension persevered to develop in March 2021, when the couple spoke out in opposition to the firm at some stage in an explosive CBS tell-all interview. However, when Elizabeth died Meghan and Harry 38, seemingly buried the hatchet with their cherished ones at least momentarily to come collectively and mourn. The twosome, who share son Archie, three, and daughter Lily, 15 months, have been noticed at a couple of occasions in London and the surrounding vicinity, with Kate and William, 40, due to the fact the Queen's passing. While Meghan seemed relatively indifferent from her sister-in-law and stepmother-in-law, 75, throughout Monday's events, her physique language used to be respectful towards the late royal. Meghan's physique language displays deference to Queen Elizabeth Cobb tells us, noting that at times, her hands have been close to her side, and at different times, they had been slightly in the front of her, with her palms clasped in the front of her decrease abdomen, regarded as the fig leaf. The professional adds, this is a closed physique language cross THAT and NBSP shows admire and maintains the center of attention off of yourself. During the funeral, the Archetypes podcast host tended to appear down and straight beforehand, and she confirmed little movement, which Cobb explains is associated to one's emotional state. When you're sad, you have a tendency to continue to be nevertheless and bow your head, especially if you don't choose others to see your emotions, and you can get misplaced in thought, she says. Although Meghan used to be bodily far off from Kate and Camilla, Cobb factors out that the Queen's service was supposed to be all about the longest reigning monarch. Now not her daughter-in-law and granddaughters-in-law. This specific second of observing Queen Elizabeth's coffin wasn't the time to engage with anyone, the specialist tells us, it was once a time to show deference to the Queen band Her Majesty's funeral proceedings. Scroll down for a first-hand appear at Meghan's physique language for the duration of the emotional service. The podcast host used to be quite distancing herself whilst outdoor Westminster Abbey. The Queen's cherished ones joined collectively on Monday to pay homage to her existence and service. Meghan, Camilla, Kate and Sophie, 57 have been all considered paying their respects to the late monarch. See